It will be obvious biography, real boyfriend, son, age, cars, and houses. Hello, viewers. Greetings according to your time. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe. And if you are returning, you're highly welcome. This video today, we're going to be talking about it will be obvious, real age, her boyfriend, her lifestyle, her son, her adopted son, her cars, and her house. Of course, her education background. So guys, for those of you that don't know Ebube Obio, Ebube Obio Cynthia is also known as Obio Olu Ebube. She's a fast-rising, talented Nollywood actress. She was born on the 12th of August 2004 in Okija, a small town in Hahiala local government area of Anambara State, Nigeria. Lali known for her role in film by Uche Nancy. One of her notable attributes is her small stature which is made her to be very popular and famous. Ebo Obio came from a family that you can describe as a low-income background. Obio is an Igbo descent. She completed her primary and secondary education in Anambara State, Nigeria. And her parents are Mr. and Mrs. Obio. She is often mistaken as the biological daughter of the famous Nollywood film producer and a cosmenia Uche Nancy due to their close relationship. But she is not related by blood, which a Nancy consider her as an adopted daughter. So, guys, for those of you that don't know, Obio has been into the Nollywood industry for the past few years. Baby Obio is well known and recognized due to her body type, which people usually mistake her as a child. Uh, guys, at the time I'm making this video, some people usually go under a baby comment section to ask if she's a child or an adult. That is the question that she always answers. She always tells people that she's an adult, she's not a child, that it's just her body type. Her body type is a blessing from God, but sometimes some people make it feel like it's a bad thing, that she's the cause of everything. But it will be used to feel bad sometimes because of the post that she used to drop and also her capture sometimes. God created everyone different and unique in our own way. And it will be body type is also beautiful and unique in her own way. This same body type that some people are criticizing is the body type that body type that has put food on it will be spirit table. It's the same body type that made it will be popular and also known so guys it's nothing to criticize her about so please if you have any advice for those criticizing her body type her look don't forget to drop it at the comment section because it's very important for her mental health her educational background it will be obvious completed her primary and secondary school in her hometown anambara state at inhala local government after her secondary school, it will be obvious didn't proceed to the university level because she needed to focus on her acting career. It will be obvious stopped at SS3 and that is it. Up till now, it will be has not seek for admission or anything. If you think it would be a good idea for her to go back to university and go and complete her education, don't forget to drop it at the comment section. But in my own opinion, I think it would be a lovely thing, a good thing for her to go and seek for admission and back to university and get her certificate. I'm not saying that she should go back to school so she can get a job and become rich. As you can see, it will be capable, it will be rich enough, she can do anything for herself at any time. I just want her to complete her education because as they always say, education is the key. I'm not saying she should go back to school so she can learn English because it, as you can see, if we can speak English fluently, she should just go back to that school because I want her to be among the graduates. I know some people will be like, there's nothing to achieve being a graduate, but of course, it's something to value. There's a value in being a graduate, so I want her to be among the educated class. If you think it's a good idea, don't forget to drop value at the comment section. It will be obvious relationship. As at the time I'm making this video, it will be obvious it's not in any relationship and has not been in any relationship. It will be obvious stated that she don't want to go into any relationship now because she has a goal. And going into a relationship might distract her from what she wants to achieve in life. Therefore, she will focus on her goal first. What are those goals? It will be obvious want to make it herself. She don't want support or from anybody she don't want any man to come and stand and start telling her tomorrow that i made you i picked you from there and i made you and all that it will be your like she always address herself boss lady it will be obvious is a boss lady she wants to do everything for herself before she can consider going into relationship or not so as i decide i'm making this video it will be obvious is proudly single her reasons is what i just stated 
a son, it will be hope you don't have a son, it will be has not adopted anybody, it will be has not given birth before. There's this picture that circulated the internet that it will be Obio has given birth. Some also say it will be Obio has adopted his son. This is not her son. I don't know who this child is to Ebube, but it should be like a close relative to Ebube Obio. So guys, this little boy you're seeing right now is not her son. She don't have a child. She's not married, and she has not given birth before, and she has also not adopted. The little boy you are seeing right now is a close relative to Ebube Obio. It's not a child. Ebube Obio's plan, as I am making this video, it's obvious that Ebube really want the best for herself. She has, she has been so hardworking, talented, and also she has been so respectful. Ebube Obio, who has been so friendly and also respectful to her elders in and out, is to go far in life. She wants to make it big in her field she wants to make it big in this nollywood industry and may god make it possible for her may god make her achieve all her plans if you love it be so much don't forget to drop a love emoji for her at the comment section and also drop a word of prayer for her at the comment section it will be obvious family Ushe Nancy is not the biological mother of Ibubi Obio. You guys all know that Ibubi Obio came from a village called Ihiala at Anambara State, Nigeria. Ibubi Obio has her own father and her mother at her village. But Ibubi Obio is a private kind of person who has refused to show her the picture of her relatives on social media except her brother. Ibubi Obio's parents are okay, they are alive because she has not posted anything about them concerning her parents or parents, I believe they are doing well in wherever they are and it's so obvious that it will be obvious is trying for her parents, is providing for her parents as well. This young lady is a really a boss lady. So Uche Nancy is an adopted mother who people usually mistake as a biological mother. If you love what Uche Nancy has done for Ibube, don't forget to drop a word of thanks for Uche Nancy at the comment section because she's really trying for Ibube Obio. And also, if you love Ibube Obio's movie, if everything you love about her, don't forget to drop it at the comment section. Concerning her relationship life, don't forget to drop a word of advice for her at the comment section. Like she always quotes, there is time for everything, which is true. If you watch this video to this time, thank you so much for doing that. I'll see you in my next video. Greetings according to your time. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I'll see you in my next video. Don't forget to drop your comments. It's highly needed. Thank you.